should look at what's under there first. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Oh, it's just a painting under here, huh? But who's that? Oh, yes. Well, what a story. I didn't remember anything at first, but the more when Frida asked me, it started coming back, little by little. Ben? You mean, you do remember? <sighs> yeah. That's me, actually, in the painting. Before I was... like this. Wait. That's you? But Ben, isn't this... Master Bernard, son to the king and queen. You... you're royalty. Ben? I... I mean, Master Bernard. Please, just call me Ben, like always. Nothing's changed, right? No, it has changed. Everything has. Huh? What do you mean? Anna? This is it. After all this time, it can come to an end now. But, but Anna, you mean we, we can't be friends? Huh? What do you mean? But that's what you said. You said it, not me. Ben, no. I mean an end to the wedding, to Winfrieda's plans. If we're looking for Janneke, and she's your mother, and you have some memory of what happened to her. The wizard, what did he say about Grandpa? That he could read memories too? Huh? This telekinesis, I think there's something else I might be able to do with it. But it might be dangerous. I should at least be closer to you before I try it. Okay. So first things first. We need to get you out of here. Let's see here. There's not really much else beside the painting. Hmm. I'll just take the painting then, and leave the frame so Winfrieda doesn't get too suspicious. Oh, hurry up with that, Anna. I don't want Winfrieda checking that while the painting's gone. My gosh, there's so much here. The machine she used on me? It looks like she considered using it on Grandpa first. There's notes about Wunderhorn, the dungeons, the castle, every place I've been to. And here, here's something about the king. Some kind of potion she gave him? That must be why he's going along with the marriage after all. Jeez, do I look dirty and ragged. Imagine if Grandpa could see me now. He'd have hang in there, Grandpa. We're close now. I shouldn't... Yeah, I wonder. Mirror, are you there? I sure could use your help again if you are. Uh, Anna, I'm pretty sure the mirror is there, but not sure it can help you much, unless you want to check your hair. <sighs> Guess she left the other one in the tower after all. It's the scrap piece of painting Winfrieda was using to check her disguise. I could pick it up to have a closer look. This, this is particularly interesting. I think I'll take a closer look, as long as I make sure I put it back the same way I found it. So this picture is what she's basing her disguise off, huh? Hmm, there's something odd about this picture. It looks like Winfrieda's disguise, but younger. Oh, and there's something on the back, too. Let's see. It says, you also hear. And then that's it. The rest looks like it got torn off. It looks like Winfrieda's disguise. Oh, and there's... It says... Wait a second. Could this really be? Maybe I'm wrong, but... No, it is from this. This is the missing piece of the portrait. But what does that mean? Who is Winfrieda disguising herself as? The minister from Wunderhorn, Theodore. He did say that this would be Queen Janneke as a child, so is Winfrieda pretending to be Queen Janneke's sister? These plans of Winfrieda's, they seem to get stranger and stranger. Oh, but then, there was that writing on the back of the scrap. So if I'm not mistaken... Aha! 
The rest of the message is on the portrait. All together it says, You also hear the other part. Hmm. I'll keep this in mind. This seems pretty important. I think I'm done with this now too. I better put it back. I think I'm done with this now too. Hmm. A whole lot of something is getting stored away in here. I'll have a look around at more suspicious looking things first. Just some drawers. Doesn't seem to be much mystery to them. Nothing in this one. And this one. Just a piece of glass? Huh. Not really sure why I'd need that. Now this is interesting. Lots of maths and stuff. But these drawings. There's a person here that's... Inside some kind of prison thing. Then over here are a bunch of shapes that look like little people. Beside them, there's a message. Little shards, little shards. In you, I confide. Kind of sounds like a spell. Or at least a bit of one. Hmm. I'll keep this in mind. This seems pretty important. Oh, I've seen this before. This was in the basement of Winfrieda's Tower. For first place in the Science Youth Fair, this certificate is awarded to Hans Lind. Hans? That wouldn't be the same Hans from the lake, would it? Winfrieda is the one who directed me there. Hmm. Hans said he tried to get the orb for someone else. What did Winfrieda have to do with that? This seems pretty important to Winfrieda. She'd notice it missing for sure. I shouldn't disturb things too much. I don't want Winfrieda knowing I've been in here. Uh, some kind of potion brewing? I don't know. I can't see any indication to show what they've been used for. I shouldn't disturb... There's Euclidean works in space and number theory. Charles Babbage and the Turing equivalent. They seem like pretty confusing sorts of books. Ah, these must be all the paintings that were taken from the castle hall. Winfrieda trying to pretend the last queen didn't exist, I guess. Uh, this room is strictly forbidden, and the butler would see me come out for sure. Let's see here. Something to look through. Something to look through. Aha! I think I know. Perfect! That's Ben! Or Master Bernard, as I found out recently. Let's see if this does the trick with Winfrieda's door code. Are you sure about this? It's not so bad, is it? Once I'm behind, it will be my eyes, so it won't look so odd. Let me show you. Anna, with your eyes, that looks even weirder. You can't even see both of your eyes. Oops, no time to debate it anymore. Here we go. Uh, eh. Hmm, this guise is still holding up at least. What do you think, Glaucus? Still looks fine to you. Oh, hoot! Ahem! Hoot, hoot! Are you quite all right, Glaucus? You sound different. Uh, Winnie! Look at me! Yes? Uh, yes! He. <laughs> um, hmm. Then, unless you have something to say about your mother's spell, then. Wait, wait, I do. You do? Tell me everything you remember now. Uh, well, yes. What do I remember? What do I remember? Get to it. A glass thing. A glass room. Shimmering 
thing. Then, of course she's in glass. You worthless. Oh, I trapped her in it myself. Trapped her? In glass? I might not have been able to reach her, but my spells could. No. Mother! Tell me what you know, Ben. Help me break her protection spell against me. Or else I'll let her wither away in that glass prison I buried her in. Even if I did know, even if I remembered anything, I would never tell you, ever. You and your family have unjustly had your place here long enough. It's my turn now. Mine. After the wedding, I'll deal with your father first, the dim-witted fool. Then, with or without your help, I'll deal with your mother, too. And there's not a thing you or that accursed girl of the West can do about it. Think on that before wasting my time, Ben. What did she mean, Anna? What is she gonna do to... to... I don't know, Ben, but the wedding hasn't happened yet. We still have time, but you... you remembered something. That's great. That means... that means it might just work. Not yet. I think it's time I finally try and do this. If Grandpa could do it, then I have to find out if I can too. Okay, don't move, Ben. First I'm going to see if I can break your cuffs. Wait, wait, wait! It's okay, I got this. I've gotten better, I swear. No, it, it's not that. It's just, maybe while we still haven't found Mother, then I think I should stay in here. But, why? What do you mean? Well, once we get me out of here, Winfrieda will have the whole castle looking for us. Maybe if she didn't suspect anything, it'd be better for us. Hmm, I see. Okay, well, I guess I can try it this way anyway. Uh, Anna? Shh, let me concentrate. Ah! Anna? Anna, are you okay? I, I think I... I saw something. It was Yannicka, I'm sure of it. I don't understand, though. Oh, wow. It did work. What else? What else? She was... praying. She looked right at you, pleading to you. No, not you. The familiar spirit. It was the spirit's memory. When she called it... Oh, wait! I saw the place she was in, and I know exactly where it is. You do? That's great! Where is it? I should have known. A glass prison, of course. Ben, she's on Glass Mountain. <gasps> You've been there before, right? The Red Dragon. I have to get to her again. Puntahorn is so far away, though. I'd never make it in time. What can I do? What can I do? I've got it. There is someone who is fast enough. Sit tight, Ben. I'll be right back. 